Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Phantom is pumping today up 13.26%. We can see it's trading at $0.24. Is this the revival of Phantom? Now at $618 million market cap. So what's going on? We can see the last day has looked really, really bullish. The last week has also looked exceptionally bullish as well for Phantom as the price appears just to be printing more and more higher highs as well as higher lows at the same time. So we can see a bit of good news here. It's now available for staking on the bit true centralized exchange fdm staking up to seven percent apy that's really really bullish as well or you can keep your funds flexible with four percent apr in power piggy so this is really really nice to see you've got this particular yield farming now available on the bit true side of things and guys i'm also doing a one thousand dollar giveaway on this channel so do subscribe the winner will be announced just tomorrow so quickly subscribe now to enter otherwise there will be no more opportunity to potentially win the one thousand dollars so yeah i'm kind of bullish on phantom right now let's take a little look at some price analysis and what else can happen as well as some 10x alt gems in the crypto market today so you can also see phantom just arrived on ledger live users can now send receive and view their ftm directly through the ledger live application so that's also something to be bullish on and another interesting thing is bear markets are for building we can see even though um, Phantom sorry, had a real colossal correction during this particular bull market, we can see, you know, looking at the all-time, it came down from highs of $3.30 all the way down to lows of like 15 to 20 cents. They are still focusing on building relationships and spreading good vibes despite the upheaval and the havoc within the blockchain market. So this is really, really important. Don't know if this is a true event, but if it is, it's really, really cool. I think it might be because we can see this guy here has got like a Phantom logo on his shirt. So I really love to see this sort of thing. And just looking at Phantom, I mean, it has been pumping today, um, of course, and over the last 48 hours, all this week, really. It really reminds me of when the price was here in July 2021, trading at around 15 cents. So in my opinion we're in the green rectangle area which i highlight as an accumulation range and uh, at the moment it does look like we are getting a nice pump to the upside we've finally got out of this little dip here where we see we we're printing a bit of a i suppose a bit of a descending triangle right here i didn't actually join these up i didn't really want to put too many patterns in because sometimes they just don't always tell the truth but you can see there's a clear sign of a healthy uptrend here and we're overextended on that 20-day moving average the volume is coming in on this daily time frame looking at the bollinger bands you can see we're pretty euphoric we're, we're overextended just like we were over here on the 5th of november uh we're overextended at the moment too so there could be a short-term correction on the way so i would steer clear from chasing the green candles we need to see what can happen here first because we are just hovering along these bollinger bands and that is high risk if you're looking to go on a long leverage trade or something like that and we are overextended on that 20 day moving average so moving over here to the hourly you can see we're still overbought on the rsi crazy amounts of volume is coming through um, but in my opinion, I would probably hold off for now to see what could happen because it might start to be looking like it's forming a bit of a rising wedge, almost a bit too good to be true, this particular price action, to be honest. Um, as we see these, got these sell-off wicks on the top of each uh, resistance trend line. We've got point three historical points here. One, two, and three. We can see we're getting sell-off at every single time we're getting rejected along this line of resistance so you could speculate that maybe we'll come up to 0 0.259 from this current price level and if we did you know it would be a very small six percent pump and we would probably see a rejection there as well so good buy zone could potentially be around 0 0.23 where we have a support trend line here of this ascending channel even though it's slightly broadening which is a little bit bearish so do keep your eye out on what could happen here for phantom i think in the short term it's hard to say exactly what will happen, uh, but looking at the analysis right here that we do see, getting this swing high over here to the swing low, we can see that we are targeting that 0 0.256 level, which is the golden pocket Fibonacci for FTM crypto. So I'd really be keen to see it come up to 0 0.256. That's my technical target. If we can recover to this swing high of 0 0.31, we might see continuation up to about $0.41 at some point in 2023. Of course, we are seeing a bit of a relief bounce in the markets at the moment. We are seeing Phantom lead in terms of the daily performance over the last 24 hours. So Phantom is doing really, really good. Bitcoin is 16.8K. Ethereum is climbing higher every single day. It was just $1,200 uh, yesterday. So we're seeing these major altcoins and blue chip cryptos slowly get their relief bounces. 
you know, and come out of these extreme fear phases that we are still unfortunately trading in. We're sitting at 29 on the uh, fear and greed index. It's not good. Now, how about some pre-sales, guys? We all love pre-sales. Uh, first thing to do is get yourself in my Discord channel down below. It's where we're talking about all trading analysis, news, next 10x cryptos, as well as four juicy pre-sales that are live at the moment. We've got the Robot Era, Cavara, Dash of Trade, IMPT. All of these are available to see, by the way, down below. And I just want to show you something very quickly on my actual uh, Patreon page. I do have a subscription available for you guys. If you want to be part of a thriving community, I've got two slots of the VIP holders left. There's 102, um, but only two now remain. This gives you early access to all the pre-sales, the white listings, etc. Um, you can see Battle Infinity did a 7.5x, Tamalo did a 19x, and we've got these four, which are currently live at the moment, and the ROI is still pending because, of course, they have not launched yet. So if you want to check out my Patreon page, check out down below, and be sure to look at the three pre-sales I am most bullish on right now, that's Dash to Trade. You can find out more down below on this one. Already raised a whopping 7.5 million and then nearly sold out of pre-sale stage three. We've got Calvaria, Plates and Battle Card Game. This one here, I'm also very, very bullish on. Uh, I do hold a lot of this one here, by the way, the Dash to Trade. Um, this one I think is amazing. It really just blows Gods Unchained out of the water. I love the graphics, the immersivity, the gameplay. And we have IMPT token and I hold about $2,000 worth of this one too. This is really cool because it's an eco-friendly carbon offset program where you can generate carbon credits and also connect yourself with socially responsible enterprises and businesses that want to reduce global warming so check out those pre-sales down below guys phantom is looking really juicy as well i think this is a long-term hodl for me now i mean just looking at this particular pattern it just screams undervalued in my opinion and look 80 percent in the circulating supply so it's a good batch of things to be excited about in the markets today check out the uh the bit true thing for the apy if you are considering locking in for apy it could be a good place to start but if you're looking for more immediate gains in my opinion dash to trade calvaria and the impt pre-sales will offer much more upside potential and of course nothing i say is financial advice make sure you subscribe and see you soon